hello cancerian welcome into the channel sage sunset healing tarot these are going to be your love messages for the week they're general messages so they may not all apply to all of you you know take the ones that apply the rest you let them fly so cancer i feel like your intuition is telling you that someone is your soulmate but you may not know for sure what is really going on here you have a feeling like someone is your north star energy it is as if you have a feeling like someone is here there's like your other half or something like that it's like the sun knows the moon is around and the moon knows the sun is around where in the sky are you i don't know but i know you're somewhere there it's like this invisible cord that really connects to people in some way shape or form and you can feel this other string or you can feel this string and you know that there's another maybe version of you which would be your soulmate energy somewhere about in this time there's a lot of distraction around you i feel like these come from your thought your patterns of thought there are things that interfere in your space i don't know why it interferes with your love especially but it does interfere with your thoughts okay so let's take a look at what this card says and i'm hearing patterns once again so without you not having you just waiting done feeling nothing it makes me sad i can't wait for a new beginning so maybe that's how you're feeling as it i don't know relates to your soulmates that you're waiting on hoping for but like i say there are thoughts that come in it is as if as soon as you begin to dream or think of this person like chemicals are automatically released that like put these thoughts back to sleep and i'm telling you it's so true it, it's like um i'm feeling like someone is doing this in some way shape or form because i'm getting the vision of someone being strapped down to one of those hospital beds but it's deep in a basement oh my god cancer i'm sorry but i know you can you can visualize what i'm seeing it's not horrible it's just that i'm feeling someone strapped down and then um it's like you're not allowed to think of this of this love because as soon as you do someone doesn't want you to i don't know who these people are or what this situation is but it's like someone really or something maybe something within your own self that really don't want you to think of this beautiful love we have the two of cups soulmate the ace twin flame the four which is like two of hearts two of hearts together and then we have the six of hearts as well like this is beautiful soulmate this person could be coming from your past energy like a past life soulmate or something like that it's precious i hear the word something precious you know but like i say it's like on i don't know who the someone or something does not want you to think of this as i feel like automatically maybe it's like you're living with another person or i'm seeing a lot of machine around you and i don't see anyone really i just see the machine and someone laying on a bed right one of those hospital beds set up with a lot of wiring and everything and then as soon as and then as soon as you maybe start thinking of love because you can't help it you know what i mean you can't help feeling this this powerful cord this connection to this soul mate the souls meet and as soon as you start thinking it as it's like automatically something is being injected in you against your will and it disrupts your thoughts your dreams and it's like someone is writhing in pain it's like you're having a bad dream you know it's like having nightmares you're on your on the bed like twisting and turning anywho yeah but i don't know like that's what the ten of swords is giving me but you see all, all, all of this love that really surrounds that energy and just i heard but there is a mastermind there's a motherfucking mastermind i don't mean to cuss i don't know why cancer you know these readings are personal to me as well you know you know we have this one someone is watching you it's like i'm saying there's a lot of wiring or something set up and this person is watching, they are even watching your your soulmate, the connection, the unity between the two. They are what it's like heartbeat. I'm telling you, it's like if the heart 
catches its proper rhythm and it's almost there it's like if if the heart becomes full they can't stop it anymore i don't know like the more you think of this love it's the more full your heart becomes but it's almost getting out of control for those that want to stop it i didn't intend for this reading to get this way it's like they can't stop this amount of love they can't they can't no matter how much they inject the horrible day nightmares and the, the horrible thoughts and the poisonous toxic this and the distractions and the lashing tongues from people around you that say things that make it seem like, listen, you're going to be alone and stuff. People say things like that to you. I can feel that. And these people could be in your family. They may not say it directly to you, but they may say like, oh, maybe you should think of getting a... A sperm donor as if you told them that you don't want a mate you know what I mean they say things like that hmm. so it could have hurt you so we have check yourself here focus sharp cutting cords we have being vigilant being assertive I feel like someone is really or something is really being asserted you need to have boundaries for mental infiltration when it comes to you manifesting your love and completing it you need to completely fill this hard space oh my god all right and then we have be bold and we have militancy scholar and someone who is very very smart as well so even though i was saying you could be done this is the energy of being smart and then we have um, forgiveness here, Grace. So either you're going to be forgiven or someone else will be. This could be a person that you held in your heart space, something like that. Someone that it's the reason why you learn to keep yourself to yourself, to be sufficient or dependent on your own self-love. And it also could be the reason why your soulmate was your twin flame was born like that north star energy you're gonna have a lot of successes too with the sun it's like after you align with this person this is what becomes of it the three maybe you will have a son a child or this is a sun energy here full expression you have my attention forgiveness vibrant expression graced and all of that all of that truthfulness divinity mm -hmm. that's for you we have the five of wrong decision here the five of swords that's a big old bird picking the fruit off of the tree right now it looks like a crow but it's actually like a raven blackbird thingy but it's big it has big beaks anywho so we have moving on for you cancer someone may be moving on and this is your weekly love reading or someone may be, may be moving towards you. Mm -hmm. Like someone may be heading or walking toward you. In your energy, we have Gemini, Libra, Aquarius. We have mm, fire, a little bit of fire. But it's Gemini, Libra, Aquarius. And then we have here creating love. And then we have someone sincere. So maybe you're going to be creating love. And I hear victory, just know. So you're going to be creating love with someone that is sincere and attractive and beautiful, all right, or even yourself. So let's see how that goes for you, my darling. Much love. Remember to like, share, comment, subscribe. Come back around again for whenever I upload your next reading. Much love. All is within you. Bye. Thank you for watching.